If you're thinking about buying or selling real estate, I'm Chris Jurich, top producing listing agent here in the San Francisco Bay Area. And if history repeats itself, we're in for a multi-year positive run-up in the residential real estate markets. This is welcome news as we're seeing active inventory increase in a massive way. We've had 50% new inventory, over 650 units, come onto the San Francisco market, and about a third of that has actually been absorbed in the last three weeks alone. And this also includes Marin County. Some 50% new inventory, we're seeing the absorption, and what that shows about our demand is that a lot of pent-up buying demand at whatever rate for homes that have not been seen is actively being absorbed. Now, home values have actually increased along with this, and that's important too, because we've seen a percentage increase in just the last three to four weeks of active trading. Everything from $580,000 on up to six and a half million, moving in the last 30 days, almost most of this is under 30 days on market in that time period alone, showing a very active, positive market and healthy market at that. Now, the recently closed sales, they're showing that it's providing some relief for the condo market. We're seeing some astounding prices. And these are, of course, triggered by things that are put your keys down and go to the movies. Maybe there's a garden, there's interior parking, other non-negotiables that the buyers would have. So, yes, they may seem as if it's picky. On the other hand, the price of borrowing has been high, so I could see why buyers have been a little bit hesitant to get into the market unless they absolutely had to move. For sellers, this is the same. We've seen them be a little more conscious about being locked into the rates under 6%, as many of them are, maybe 80 or 90% of most homeowners have a lot of equity or a portion of a rate lock, if that makes sense. Now, the luxury market, parking has been a non-negotiable for many years and for most properties. And since the price of a basic condominium or single family home rises up to above seven, eight, nine hundred thousand dollars throughout the Bay Area, you could see why people have been slow to latch on to the purchase power of anything above five and a half, six percent. With the downward trend of the mortgage interest rate Fed cut, that means that we're going to see a new cycle of buyers who've been on the fence getting back into the market and potentially sellers too, as they're seeing a healthy amount of inventory for them to remove themselves from their current property into upsizing or downsizing. Now, that current forecast is also a downward cycle, so there could be some waiting that happens this autumn. What we're seeing in this active market, though, is a refreshing look at new inventory. And for sellers, while the market is slower, if you are patient and you prepare thoroughly, ask me how, then from that standpoint, I think you're going to see some success. For the buyers, this is a golden opportunity. I'm suggesting get ahead of the curve, at least be very clear on your financing and buying power, be crystal clear on your location and what's going to work for your family size. That being said, if I can answer any questions, as always, contact me direct. I'd love to work with you. I hope you're having a great autumn and enjoying the sunshine.